lovelies, this is Megan, and today we are drawing donuts. To start off, we are going to draw a circle, and I recommend starting with a pencil and lightly drawing it first, and then go over it with pen. And then, in the inside of our donut, we're going to draw another circle. Okay, so for our sprinkles, we're going to draw hearts, but if you don't like hearts, you can always use a different shape. So when you're drawing your sprinkles, for example, if you're using hearts, you want them to go in all different directions, like you actually sprinkled them onto your donut. Okay, and then we're going to draw a circle on the outside of our mini circle, and then a larger circle on the inside of the large circle. Now, these don't have to be perfect because donuts are far from perfect. And here are some other sprinkles that you can add. You can add hearts and draw circles. And you can draw little cylinders and I'll show you those later on. Okay, so for our next donut, we're going to draw a long drawn. So this is a rectangle, but on the edges you want them to be rounded and then if you want a bite out of your donut you can do a little wavy mark kind of like a snake now make sure all your lines are nice and rounded and then on the inside we're going to do a little outline it can be a little wobbly because this is our icing line and then for our icing we're going to do a fun little swirl so to get some practice with the line, you can do the motion back and forth, back and forth before you try it with your pencil or your pen. And it kind of reminds me of a snake. Something else that'd be really cool is to write a word in icing. So you can write your name or your initials. And then for some sprinkles, we're going to draw some circles. And you can just put them anywhere on your donut. And now we're going to make a heart donut. I like to start toward the bottom and make a diagonal to the left. And then have a curve that goes down. And then another curve that goes up. And then make a diagonal down. And then a curve at the bottom. And make another diagonal. And then we're just going to do the same motion. A curve, another curve down into the diagonal, and then another curve to an upper diagonal. Okay, and then we're gonna make some more sprinkles. And of course, I chose hearts again, and they're all going different directions. And when you make your hearts, well, your heart donut, Make sure all the curves are nice and smooth. You don't want them to be pointy because it's a donut and when things bake, they're usually nice and round. And here are the cylinder sprinkles that I was talking about earlier. They kind of remind me of a long drawn donut. <laughs> and then after we're done decorating our donuts, it's time to color. <laughs> And I really like to use colored pencils or acrylic paints. But for this one, I'm using a bright yellow. And I'm just doing it nice and soft all around the circumference of the donut. Now try to make it all go in the same direction. So like I said, mine's just kind of going in this circular motion. And if you're wondering, my other donuts that I have displayed in the video are actually painted. Okay, so then to give it some more dimension, we're going to use a darker yellow and we're going to add extra pressure when we're coloring and that's going to be on the inside of our donut on, and on the very edge of our donut. And for your donut, you don't have to use yellow. You can use any color you want. You can even make it rainbow. <laughs> and then for the sprinkles, I'm going to use pink and a nice turquoise. And then for the donut part, I'm going to use a light brown. 
So those are a few ways you can draw donuts. So thank you so much for watching this how to draw video and if you have any recommendations for future videos, please let me know in the comments. Well, I hope you have an amazing day. Toodles!